This may look like a stainless steel freight train that wandered into an aircraft museum, but this is the Bud Conestoga, one of the most forward-thinking cargo aircraft ideas to come out of World War II. It was designed in 1944, during a real fear that aluminum shortages could slow wartime aircraft production. Bud, famous for building stainless steel railroad cars, offered a bold solution. Build the airplane largely out of stainless steel instead. Using manufacturing techniques adapted from rail car production, they created an airframe that looks, and ages, very differently than the aluminum transports we're used to seeing. The cockpit sits high above the cargo deck, leaving the fuselage wide, flat, and unobstructed. From the very beginning, this aircraft was built around one obsession, faster loading with less effort on the ground. And even though this survivor here is wingless and stripped today, the Conestoga originally used a high-wing tricycle gear layout to keep the cargo floor low and level, perfect for rolling equipment straight inside. Now the signature move, the rear loading ramp beneath an upswept tail. In the 1940s, that was a big deal. Decades before rear ramp cargo aircraft became the standard shape of airlift around the world. The twist is, the crisis it was built for never fully arrived. Aluminum supply stabilized, the Conestoga showed up late, production was cut short, and most were quickly retired. But it didn't fail. It previewed the future, and this battered survivor at Pima is the proof.